In this problem, we're going to find the equation of the line that passes through this point and is parallel to this line. And we need to write our answers in point slope form and also in slope intercept form. Let's go ahead and work through its solution. So to find the equation of a line uh, in point slope form, we just need uh, a point and a slope. So we already have the point it's given to us. So negative five comma negative five. We just need the slope, which is m. So we're told that our line is parallel to this line. Parallel lines have the same slope. And so if you look at this line, it's already in slope intercept form. It's in the form mx plus b. So via matching, you see that m is equal to negative five because parallel lines have the same slope and our line is parallel. So the slope here is negative five. So our slope must also be negative five. So let's go ahead and do part A. Part A wants point slope form. So let's go ahead and write down the formula. That would be y minus y1 equals m parentheses x minus x1. So now we just plug in the numbers. So it'd be y minus negative five, or just y plus five, it'll become positive and then negative five, so many negatives, everything's a negative five. <laughs> uh, negative five, it's ridiculous. So uh, on the left here, it'll become y plus five, and then here it's negative five, and this will be x plus five. Good stuff. This is y, plus, oh, so that's the answer, right? That's, that's the, this is, it's gonna keep going, this is the point slope form, so we're done. Now, to get the second part, you keep going, right? You basically solve for y. Whenever it asks you for this, you wanna write it like this. So you just wanna solve for y. So if we were to keep going here, we would get y plus five. Then we would distribute the negative five. So negative five times x is negative five x. And then negative five times five is uh, negative 25. Then you just subtract five from both sides, subtract five. So we have y equals negative 5x minus 30. And this would be the slope intercept form. So uh, and that's it. I hope this video has been helpful. Good luck.